During the Give Help Now campaign, we had over a thousand people uh, who gave money to match the initial 500,000. And so today was our uh, distribution of those funds for $1,074,294. And uh, over um, 20 organizations uh, received funds from us uh, for this Give Help Now campaign. I'm uh, very, very proud of Fresno, uh, proud to have been the chair of this campaign. And uh, thank God for the people's generosity who stepped up during this time of need uh, during the pandemic. This means so much to organizations like the Marjorie Mason Center. You know, it was only two months ago that we were having to make that hard decision about whether or not we would be able to keep our, our fundraiser. We only have one fundraiser a year to meet the needs of the survivors in the community that rely upon us, and we were having to cancel it. Um, Three weeks later, we were given the announcement of this amazing opportunity through Give Help Now and philanthropists in our community who wanted to step up and ensure that the critical resources of nonprofits in our community continued even through COVID-19. And I am overwhelmingly humbled by the generosity of those who gave. This support today, this contribution to Pavarello House means so much. The timeliness of it could not be better. As Pavarello House continues to serve the needs of this community during COVID-19, it's challenging for us to ensure that we have the resources to make sure that people have food, that people have shelter, that we're able to provide emergency food bags for families throughout this community impacted by COVID-19. So this support of the, of the community, uh, it means more than we could say. We're grateful beyond what we could say. Uh, but this support will allow us uh, to continue to move forward uh, on the front lines of this crisis to meet the needs of our community.